Heyo, Josh here again with another La Marzocco quick tip video. Today we're going to focus on ABR, ARB, also known as auto brew ratio. There are thousands of ways to approach dining in coffee. I could talk about that at length, but no one would want to listen to me do that. One of those methods is brewing ratios. Essentially, you're taking the amount of coffee going into the portafilter, and then you're timesing it by a certain amount to give you the output. An example would be 20 grams in to 40 grams out. That gives you a one to two brewing ratio. Now, if you're like me and you've nearly failed every math class you've ever taken, have no fear. The La Marzocco has software that does this math for you. Once in brew ratio mode, it's very easy to scroll left and right to enter the brewing ratio that you would like the machine to produce. Initially, there are a couple steps that you'll need to follow. First, you need to weigh your portafilters. You'll do this by using the double cup button, holding it down, placing your portafilter on the scale in the channel with nothing in the basket, and waiting for it to read its weight. Next, grind, dose, and tamp like you normally would for any other shot. Hold down the single cup button until cough comes up on the screen. Place your portafilter with your coffee on the drip tray, and now the machine's going to weigh it for you. In this case, the coffee weight is gonna come out to right about 18 grams. Finally, lock in your portafilter, place your cup on the scale, push the single button like you normally would for your shot, and let the machine go to work. In this instance, we programmed in a one to two brewing ratio. It took that first number, times it by two, and it'll stop this shot at 35.8. But if you find that your grinder fluctuates a little bit between each dose, ABR is really awesome. When you weigh the coffee before each shot, the machine will automatically take that number and apply the brewing ratio, adjusting your final shot weight depending on whatever input was recognized. Now, there's a chance you may be thinking, that's way too many steps for my busy bar. Why would I want to weigh the portafilter, grind my coffee, weigh the coffee, start the shot, stop the shot? That's so many steps. But you can skip a lot of that because we have these. Uh, it may look like a normal portafilter, but it's not. This is a precision portafilter. They come in sets of two and three. And on the bottom, you have a three digit code of either letters or numbers. This one is BR7. I think it's also the name of Elon's new child. But this BR7 matches up to this BR7. Now what that means is that if this set is paired with precision portafilter baskets, they will weigh exactly the same. So therefore, once you initially weigh the portafilter, you can skip that step entirely during your coffee making process. And now for your speedy bar flow, grind those tamp like you normally would, hold down that single cup button, wait till coffee appears on the screen, weigh your dose, and then quickly insert it, place your cup, and push start. And there you go. That's how you can utilize EVR in a very busy bar setting. We hope you enjoyed this quick tip video. Of course, if there's anything else that you'd like us to focus on in our next series, please shoot us a comment or send us an email. We'd love to hear from you. Otherwise, stay safe out there. Until next time.